my they place. put this on my plate. I will not. They, no, I don't do what they do. I do what I do. Mm. I'm a visionary. I believe it. Mm. But she's I my would coach. never eat a plate that looks like this. You mm. mm. pay me a million dollars to do that to my plate. Mm. Oh my god! Because it comes through better than that. It's mm. low vibration. And you took it. I would have been like, I'm playing like that. I tell you what I want. You don't tell me what I want. So my thought process is if you can put it on my plate, but I don't have to eat it. I got the distance. I won't even look at it. It look that make me look bad. I'm a queen. Queen is plate from like. Mm. If, I, if we said two plates, we play together. And so who's royalty? They would say this person. Mm. I agree. That's a good way. <laughs> this is <laughs> this is my chick. Yeah, because it's a lot of people that just let people give them what they want them to have, mm-hmm. and they accept mm-hmm. it. And Storm is teaching me right now. Yeah, yeah. Cold Storm is teaching me don't accept what they put on your. Mm. Stormy Wellington has always been problematic to a lot of people, but recently she went viral for picking at her friend's food plate for being low vibrational because she had burgers, wings, and other choices. Stormy said her plate is royalty in comparison to her friends, but she gave me the vibes that she's just trying to put someone down to build herself up. I could see Stormy's point more if she was eating fruits and vegetables, but she was eating the same thing her friend was, just in a smaller portion. I understand having the opinion of thinking meat is low vibrational, because it was a live animal that was killed but still that's your opinion because the next person may feel food is food circle of life but you eating the same low vibrational how you tell it food as her i agree with stormy on some of her rhetoric but not this and her friends were yes man in her to not make her mad, but I'm always speak up. That's a lesson. That was my, they going crazy on me right now. There's no way Tammy needed two hamburgers, no. No. two no. hot dogs, no. broken beans, beans no. potato yes. salad, and four motherfucking drinks. No. But guess what? She had a friend and a coach yes. 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 that she knows love her. That's right. That's, that's, that's right. right. No, I need y'all to hear this. They should be applauding me right now. Yeah, I said if two plates, forget mine is our face. Yeah. If your plate and my plate were put in the fourth one, they said who's the plate and who's the hood rat? Yeah. They would say the plate with the two hot dogs, two hamburgers, who is the hood rat? You weren't calling me Come a damn on. hood rat. That's yeah. why y'all gotta know who y'all are. Because see, you'll leave this weekend, look how this enemy works. Mm-hmm. People are gonna try to put in her. Somebody told her, I need to find Coach Tommy because I need to be her ass. Come on. Because she called me a hood rat. Say what? Listen, she didn't I'm call you. And I feel like that type of food is okay sometimes. Maybe not eat large portions of it every day because it can take a negative effect. But still, do you enjoy things in life and don't minimize yourself to make someone else feel big? What are your thoughts on the situation? Please like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching.